I told you there was a way for crypto wallets to be smarter, easier to use, and more secure. Sounds futuristic, right? Welcome to the world of smart wallets. In one of my previous videos, I talked about account abstraction. In this video, we are talking about something closely related, which are smart wallet if you're already using a crypto wallet right now you would agree with me that it can feel a bit manual especially when it comes to signing transactions or managing your private key but what if your wallet could handle some of those tasks for you automatically and securely and yes there's also the aspect of where social login like your google account your social media accounts are being used to even make smart wallets easier at the end of this video you're going to learn about smart wallets how they work and why they are important if you have not already subscribed to this channel please do well to subscribe like this video already because i promise you that it's going to be great and of course share this video with as many people as you can very important okay now let's jump right into the video hello welcome back to our youtube channel my name is Lori praise i'm a blockchain developer and developer advocate so what exactly is a smart wallet and how does it work smart wallet takes the concept of a crypto wallet and auto charges it with programmable features and automation instead of requiring you to sign every transaction your smart wallet allows you to predefine certain rules with a smart contract for example you can set a condition to automatically approve any transaction below hundred dollars or require multiple approval on a particular transaction now all of these things are going to run by themselves without you necessarily supervising that is how a smart wallet works what makes smart wallets different is their flexibility and this is thanks to account abstraction this feature allows wallets to separate their transaction logic from their wallet underlying security, making them more customizable for different use cases. So smart wallet enables smoother user experience, making Web3 more accessible for people that may not be tech that. So think about it like giving your wallet some brains. Now, a good example is you want to shop online and you don't want to have to approve every single transaction yourself. So you can actually customize that and automate it. And then for every purchase that you make, those purchases are automatically carried out of course you can ensure that for large transactions it requires your approval but yeah that's like is a good scenario of how smart wallets can be used smart wallets are not just a good to have in the web3 space but they are gradually becoming a necessity as the space grows and more people get into the ecosystem so if you've been following the rise of DeFi platforms you will notice and increase demands for automated and secure wallets instead of approving every action in a DeFi platform like staking or withdrawing funds you can preset um, rules that just run by themselves and automate this action based on specific conditions not only does it save you time it also reduces the chances of human error, making Web3 more user-friendly. Now, one of the coolest features of smart wallets is the integration of social login. When using a traditional crypto wallet, you need to manage your private keys. And this could be a hassle for beginners. And it's actually very risky because if you lose your private keys, you literally lose like all the funds in your wallet. However, with social login, you can access your accounts using credentials from social platforms like Google, Twitter or Facebook just like how you log into apps or websites and personally I think that this is actually very cool because when you are trying to get more users into web3 you don't want to bore them with telling them to write down 24 seed phrases or maybe write down their private key if they are using social login using their social media accounts they are easily able to create wallet accounts and this is actually really great to bring in more people into the space how does this work now when you create a wallet with your social login um the system divides your private key into multiple parts multiple encrypted parts of course and then stores them in different places so a part of it is being stored on your device and the other part might be stored um, by the wallet provider this technology is called multi-party computation mpc to log into your device your wallet provider and your device combines both parts together to a complete private key so that 
the private key is never exposed to one party and this is actually security. Now why is social login and smart wallet important? The bottom line is that this is actually very important for onboarding new people easily into the Web3 space. So it allows people to actually adopt Web3 without worrying about the security risks that comes with managing private keys, that comes with signing and selling transactions. So that is how smart wallets work and that is how social logins come in to make it even more seamless. I hope you learned a thing or two from this video. If you found this video helpful, then please do well to subscribe to this channel and share this video and of course this channel with as many people as you know. Don't forget to also hit the like button so that the YouTube algorithm will show this video to more people. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!